Hey guys and welcome back to Born Traveller. Right, I've realised I've got to start uploading more videos. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start doing like short videos like this, just travel advice. So here in Istanbul, I'll give you some top tips for Istanbul. So it's going to be like a two or three minute video. Wow. So my top tips is uh, when you first arrive at the international airport, just literally uh, take the public transport. Do not bother with taxis. You can, the, the buses run all day and they're really simple and convenient. You just have to get one of these, what's called an Istanbul cart card. So once you've got one of these cards, you can just jump on a bus, bus metro or a boat. And it's dead easy to get around Istanbul. It's quite easy to top the card up. You just top it up with uh, 10 or 20 lira. And most of the journeys cost about three, three lira, which is uh, 50 cents. So my next tip is bring a travel kettle, a bowl, a spoon, and a cup. Because here you can get breakfast and lunch just by buying the basics. Uh, most hotels have a fridge. So all you need to buy is some fresh bread, some cheese, uh, and some little mini sausages, and you can make yourself breakfast. Um, if you've got one of my travel kettles, or a collapsible travel kettle, or you've got a hotel that's got a kettle in it, then you can just buy the instant coffee. That'll save you about 50 lira per morning. So the third tip is, most good things to see in Istanbul are free. The mosques, um, a lot of the sites, the, the ferries, they're either very cheap or almost next to nothing. As I say, the only one you've got to play for is the palace. I haven't done that, I'll probably do that next time. Tip four is clothes shopping. If you don't want to buy any clothes, definitely come to Istanbul. Because of the pandemic, the lira is very little in value at the moment. It's like nine to the dollar. So it's really, really good value. Um, you can get a t-shirt for like uh, maybe three or four dollars. It's quite good quality. So a pair of jeans is only maybe eight, nine dollars. So really good value here. The second part to that is don't buy electronics. If you want to buy electronics, do not buy them in Turkey. It is very, very expensive. So any electronics, buy them before you get here. My fifth tip is fruit and vegetables. Um, the Turkish diet, or certainly what's in the restaurants, tend to be there's not a lot of vegetables in it. So I would really recommend buying and eating as much fruit and vegetables as you can. Because honestly, you're really not going to get much in the Turkish diet from what you get in the restaurants. So as you can see, you've got pizza, They've got meats, a lot of the, a lot of them, this is breakfast, so again, there's no vegetables. The Turkish breakfast has some, but only cucumber, which is not much value. The only thing really you can get is the Mediterranean salads, but that's really the only ones you can get. In terms of vegetables, no broccoli, no peas, no carrots, there's just hardly anything. So guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. That's my top five tips for Istanbul. Please remember to subscribe to the channel, turn on the notification button, and I'll see you next time.